five different stage of the leaf before the leaves is completely dried up and fall off. The first is when you're gonna see these yellow spots right here. See these yellow spots that popping up all over your leaves right there? And then eventually it's gonna look like burn spots, like they're getting burned, like blister spots. And then now the leaves now is gonna dry up, like curl up, and you can see more bigger uh, brown and yellow spot. And then you come over here now, now the leaf is gonna look disgusting, dried up more, and then you come back to the final stage. This is where the leaf turn dried up and every single thing, and then it'll fall off. So this is downy mildew. And right in here, we got a spray bottle. And then in this spray bottle, I'm gonna tell you exactly what I have. Downy mildew is different from powdery mildew. They're basically the cousin. Powdery mildew has the white powder spot. Mix some baking soda with water, a spray bottle, and you could get rid of that. So in this spray bottle here, we have hydroperoxide, 3%. And basically what I did is mix about four to six tablespoons into a gallon of water. And I mix that up real well, and then I pour it in my spray bottle. Make sure to do this in the evening time. I'm going to show you how I'm spraying. Evening time, do not do this in the morning. Do not do this when it's hot, it's hot sun. You're going to cause more problem. You could do this every three, four days and until the problem is solved. And I'm going to show you what else we could do to avoid and to prevent this problem. This happens, this fungus would happen when the weather, the humidity level is high and low, when it's too much rain, it's too much crowded, it's natural, it's common, and it will happen. And it could actually go from plants to plants. So we got to make sure we treat this right away. Got it really bad on some of these plants, but as you can see, I pruned out a bunch of lower leaves already, which we're gonna have to prune out more. I'm a little late behind this, that's why it's like this. So we're gonna prune out all of the, those one at the bottom, and we're gonna still remain at least about eight to 10 leaves. So we're the whole leaves on the top like that, right? Be generous. And then you come at the bottom, and then you spray the bottom, get the underneath of the leaf, and then get the main stem. Get the stem all the way down to, like that and if you have a plant leaf that's close to it you could spray the plant leaf just in case but that's how you spray it all the leaves we're gonna have to go even like say we stop this is our last one right here but if you look at the tip right here it's already coming so we're gonna spray even the good one we're gonna spray the good one well this ain't good one but we're gonna spray all the good one even we want to make sure it doesn't spread out through our cucumber plants we got a flower open we're gonna try our best to avoid that flower to spray the flower if we can but the flower is probably already pollinated because it only pollinates in the morning time. A couple hours it open in the morning time. But, so that's how you get rid of downy mildew. You could also mix uh, baking soda with water or you could even use milk. But I feel uh, hydroperoxide does the best. 